After 10,000 years, finally I'm on a hashtag video! <laughs> hey guys, this is DJ from that hashtag show with the one and only Jason Abara. Hello. You might know him as Babu from Mighty Morphin. You might know him from the TMNT band. You might know him touring with Vanilla Ice. Matter of fact, aren't you doing more with Vanilla Ice? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to be on the upcoming season of uh, the Vanilla Ice Project. You are a busy man. Yeah, I need sleep and a shower and a meal. In no specific order. Yeah. Now, with that said, actually, how did, how did that even come about? How did that whole arrangement with Vanilla Ice even start? Uh, so, I have had the van for about five years, which the anniversary of the van is actually Halloween uh, night. Happy, happy anniversary, man. <laughs> so that's five years I've had this thing now, and uh, two years after I had the van made, I found a guy that, that made the turtle costumes, and so uh, I bought my first one, which was Michelangelo. Started doing birthday parties and stuff, and then I got, I got known for having the suit, and I branded it TMNT Van, and then uh, a guy out of Texas, his name was Jared, he was having a, a thing called Jared's Epic Party. Look that up on the internet. It's pretty, pretty amazing. And uh, so two years ago, he hired my group uh, to perform with Vanilla Ice for the first time, doing the ninja rap on stage in front of like, I think it was 5,000 people. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. That's yeah. like my childhood right there. Dude, that's awesome. So uh, we became friends after that and, you know, just started doing local shows when he was over here, like in Long Beach and stuff like that. Sure, sure. And then we became friends, and now I'm on tour with them. Uh, we're doing the I Love the 90s tour right now. We've been doing that since uh, late er, late last year. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. I'm telling you this right now. Like, the TMNT van is, like, top three fictional vehicles I would love to own. And Who it's the first two? Knight Rider kit. Okay, me too. Back to the Future DeLorean. Okay, okay yeah, dude. Simpatico, look at that. Yeah. Ranger family, I'm telling you. All right, so, Babu. Okay, for those who don't know, my man here is Ranger family for like ever. This dude is like one of the hardest working Ranger guys I've ever met in my life. I'm a lifer. I'm he is a lifer. He, long time membership. Like don't even don't even question it. So talk to me about that dude, talk to me about that whole thing getting started and even how how it progressed for like nine seasons. Man, let me tell you, it was it was so much luck involved. I didn't want to be an actor. Uh, I, was, I actually wanted to do radio, but as you can tell by my voice, I don't have a very good voice or pronunciation. I, I love your voice, and you speak very well. So, uh, I got hired to be an extra on Power Rangers, like a regular person, like at the juice bar, you know? And uh, just one day, I was there for like a week, and, and uh, one of the stuntmen had gotten hurt on set, and it was a non-union show, so they came into the room of all the guys and all the girls, and like, who wants to be a ranger for the day? And I just sat in the corner, right? Because I didn't, I didn't care. Well, all the guys were buffer than me, bigger than me, so they couldn't be rangers because all the rangers at the time were Japanese men in the suits. And I was this scrawny little kid, and they went through everybody. They're like, hey, what about you in the corner? And so I'm like, all right, I'll do it. Wait, wait, let me get this straight. Randomly, they at, like you're just a kid at the time, and they ask you who wants to be a ranger? Well, it was, it was something simple. Like yeah. They were just in the command center holding something. There was no karate involved. Sure, sure. Something simple. But did you know how big Power Rangers was at oh, that no, time? Oh, yeah, yeah. I did that. They had just had that big thing in Universal, which I saw on the news, so I knew it was a pretty big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and so they, even though they came out to put to put somebody in the Red Ranger costume, that's not where they ended up putting me. They put me in Babu because I was skinny enough to fit in the damn thing. The infamous Babu is so legit. Like, if you've seen his pictures in the Babu suit, it's super, super awesome. Okay, so you went from Babu. Take us, take us through the journey, man. Take us through the journey. So I was Babu, and uh, I did that for the, a couple days, and then uh, then they needed the Red Ranger again. So then I, I filled in because I, I started at the same time Steve Cardenas and Johnny Bosch, and Karen started. The Texas crew. Yeah, the Texas crew. Uh, I started the exact same day. I became, uh, you know, Rocky's double when there wasn't very much martial arts going on. I, I want to stress that because a lot of people say that I'm a liar and all this other. <laughs> but uh, who says that? <laughs> all the haters. All the haters, you know it. No hating in Ranger fandom, all right? No hating. So, uh, you know, I became Rocky's double, and uh, but mainly it was it was with Rita. I was Babu. But anytime they were in Zed's palace or Rita's palace, so that's how I started, and it, it gave me a job for nine years. Not not very many people in the acting world can say they had a job for nine years. Dude, that's a hundred and ten percent correct, dude. And the fact is, you're awesome with your fans, man. You you always show nothing but love, man. So I appreciate right, you personally. Man, you know, we're all here because of the fans, you know, and without you guys, you know, we'd just be at home, you know, so we got to give back. You, you can't be, you can't be like that, you know? Sure, sure. And I'll tell you what, I mean, the best part about it is, didn't want to be an actor, 
and ends up getting work for nine years. That's incredible, man. I'm, I'm blessed and, and I'm honored, you know? Yes, sir. To be, especially to be part of a, a franchise like this. Sure. It's like, just like, the, like what Star Trek and Batman and all that stuff is, you know? Absolutely, absolutely. All right, my man, are you down to take a little Ranger quiz? Uh, sure. <laughs> and we have, we, I'm going to have to dust off my, my, my books. <laughs> hey, hey, nine years is a long time. All right. Where did the season of Mighty Morphin take place? What city? Angel Grove. Ding, ding, ding. Okay, okay. That was the, that was the warm-up. Uh, let's see. What were the henchmen of Time Force? The bad guys. Oh, man. Uh, Cyclobot. That's, I, don't, I don't know that, where I pulled that out of. We, I that's called dusting it <laughs> off and pulling it out of the hat. So we made that work. All right, man. Because, okay, here's the thing. He has like nine seasons. All right, all right. Here's the curveball. What was Babu's last name? Uh, they didn't give him one. <laughs> I think because he was in the background being kind of worthless. He was, okay, first of all, season one henchmen. Everyone knows season one henchmen, all right? Maybe not the other seasons, but everybody knows Squad, Babu, Goldar, all the good stuff. But if... If Babu had to have a last name, what would it be? I guess Awesome. Babu Awesome. Babu, you heard it here first on the hashtag show. He's officially known as Babu Awesome. <laughs> All right, man. How about this, dude? Can you sing a theme song for me? Let's. No, yes, we are. We're going to do Turbo. How about Turbo, man? Do we, do we remember Turbo? Come on, man. I remember the, the start of the car in the beginning, but I don't remember the words. Go! Power Rangers Turbo. Go. Power Rangers Turbo. Go. Power Rangers Turbo. Oh. Okay, <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, Danny. Oh, Jay, no. Oh. Okay, you know, okay. Okay, there's a story to that. I called him Danny one time. I swear to you, and I swear on everything I love. I have a classmate in high school named Danny Ibarra. So, Danny Ibarra. Does he look like yes. Him? What? No. Wear a vanilla ice cap? No. Okay, okay. First of all, that's not, that's not something a lot of people can say. Jason Navarro, thank you so much for joining us, man. Hey, thank you, guys. I appreciate you. And thank you, everybody out there. Thank you so much. Thanks, guys.